Hello, hello to you. I almost just said aloha, sprinklerinos. Old habits die hard. Um, I don't want you to see all my mess in the background here, but I haven't really done a tidy up. Um, I just popped you up on the windowsill. Um, I wanted to intro this video. It's a mini vlog. Last week I went to the Bloggersphere Awards, which are hosted by Bloggersphere magazine, um, and something pretty amazing happened at the awards. I might have given it away in the title of this video. Um, if not, maybe I didn't, and you'll have to keep watching. But basically, I filmed a few snippets and I thought it'd be nice to make like a mini vlog of it. One, to share it with you because I used to share this sort of stuff all the time. Like I would have never have gone to an event without a camera in my hand. And then over the years I started to feel like maybe that wasn't interesting to you or maybe it was a bit like... I, I thought I got to a point where I felt like it was a bit knobby to constantly be like, ooh, look at me, I'm at another red carpet event, oh, look at me. Um, so I stopped sharing them as much. But I thought this one would be a good one to share because Bloggersphere is all about digital creators. And the category that I was nominated in was for um, my charity campaign with the NSPCC, which is called Now I Know, which all of you were part of because I did that 10 hour live stream and we all raised like over 40,000 pounds in the end and it was amazing. Um, so, I'm making it into a video. I have, don't mind me, just pulling my jeans up here. Uh, I have already put together the footage that I filmed on my phone. I won't lie to you, it's not my best filming work. I literally just filmed bits as and when and I was enjoying myself, enjoying all my friends and I had a couple of drinks as well. Um, so it really is just some bits and clips, as it were. I'm seeing her soon, by the way. If you know, you know. Some of you might be like, seeing who? Bits and clips. Yes, I am, and I can't wait. Um, so yeah, I will stop whiffle waffling and enjoy the mini vlog. Giraffes. Yes. Giraffes. I've never seen, seen one. Giraffes. That's going to be the enclosure. There's absolutely. Can you imagine that you can see giraffes? Oh, We're just going past. Hi, this is Nick, the wonderful driver. Hello. There he is. Now you're in a YouTube video. It's official. Nick's the best driver ever. Thank you. I'm in Nick's car a lot for <laughs> driving. <laughs> for I'm not for trips for work <laughs> God. also apologies i think i had my hand on the mic then which actually would have just been you're an absolute would have been... <laughs> get it round, it's not the loud we're on a f you don't like vlogging on the phone, do you? I don't know where to look, but it's that side, isn't it? It is. You just gotta look at my hole on the side there. <laughs> there you go. As we cross a um, road. As we cross a very yeah. same look. I'll show you the venue. It looks swish. Oh yeah. If anything says professional experience, it's like 30 foot banners, isn't it? That's made it for me. I wasn't sure about the event before I saw those, but now I have, there now I go. know. <laughs> This is this is for this is for important people. <laughs> it's Katie Pix. Oh, Here she is. She's vlogging on a phone like, for YouTube. Old school. Oh, the olden days. Oh, yeah, on my phone because my bag is small. Smart. Done some photos. Nice chandelier. Up we go. Questioning my fitness levels. Into the party room. Lovely. Yeah. Oh, the sky is on fire. The lake has turned to. 
moment because the night just got kind of got, went away with me um but you know when people say sorry if you can hear my uh washing machine in the background there um you know when people say oh i really wasn't expecting to win and you think well you were because you were nominated and you were at the award ceremony so there must have been a part of you that was expecting to win i promise you there was no part of me that was expecting to win that there was someone else in that category that i thought oh they for sure I'm gonna take that um, take that award home with them tonight. Um, and I was ready and I was like, they're a worthy winner and I'm happy for them and I've like come to peace with it. And then when they said the NSPCC, I was like, Ugh! and a little part of me wishes that I had pre-prepared something to say because I ended up just getting really choked up on stage in front of like an entire venue full of people. Um, but it meant a lot to me. This means such a lot because it means that more eyes now are on the NSPCC and on my campaign, now I know. Um, and it means that people care, that it matters, that children's voices matter and the children that can't speak out for themselves, like I couldn't speak out for myself, have more attention on them now so can be helped and offered support and resources and if needed, you know, helped out of those situations. So, um, yeah, it was a really, it was really dear to my heart, and I've been really fortunate over the last few years to have cool things happen and awards and things like that. But this one, because it's about something so close to my heart, um, it really meant a lot to me. I've actually put the award in my lounge, front and centre, um, and it's the only one there. <laughs> it just sits happily. Um, so yes, thank you for watching that. I shall remember that night for a long time. It's a really special evening, and I'm glad that I've documented it here on my little home uh, YouTube. Uh, yeah, okay, more videos to follow, leave a friendly comment, hope you enjoyed the shorter video, that's it from me.